Welcome back, everybody. It's another thrilling episode. Um, and by thrilling, dude, do I mean thrilling. Like, today, we'll maybe catch some bears killing animals for... Whoa, what in the... What is this thing? I've never seen this guy before. What? Where's my magic lasso? What is this? This is a norm. It eats apples. Hey, you norm thing. That's the weirdest thing ever. Um, I don't have any apples, actually. Like, at all. And I totally missed that. So, I guess I'm gonna have to go find some apples real quick. Apples, apples, apples. Where would I find apples? Well, in the woods, of course. Whoa, 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 whoa. So many other things in the woods as well. Oh, dragons. Oh, that's totally cool, you know? <sighs> Dude, I literally just jumped from that. I don't even know what it was, but something blew up. <sighs> no, whoa, hey! Get out of here. Where's my Nyan sword when you need it? Not in the hot bar because. Okay. All I want to do is get some apples. Okay, well, that thing's going to despawn. And it's dark. So why don't I run back to someplace safe ish? Until I fall to my death. Oh, great. Um, somewhere around here, I do like, oh, come on, really? No, die. There we go. I do like how these windows let out so much light. Oh, yeah, I spruced this up with a little bit of bone meal. Added a bunch of flowers. Uh, sand and bones. Well, thanks, whoever gave me the sand and the bones. Um... I always need those. Sand, actually, I do for glass. Bones? I don't know. Um, I pulled this Wawa. I don't know. I think I'm going to put it back in. Because then I feel like I'd have to pull out this one, this one, and this one. And I really don't want to do that. Um, take a quick look at the garden here. I will end up removing all of these flowers, I think. They really don't do anything here. Ah, the cotton finally grew. I, um, only one seed out of it, though. That's useless. All those palm leaves never went away by themselves. So I just went ahead and manually removed them all. Because they were just being stupid and annoying and making a mess. Keeping things from growing. So I eliminated them. Got rid of that problem. Um, let's see, what else may I have done off camera? I think that was really it. I didn't really do a whole lot of landscaping around the place. I will in future episodes. But I didn't do that yet. Uh, these carrots aren't all grown, as aren't those caught in there. I th think, just for the time being, I'm going to go ahead and grow more of these. I want to grow more uh, carrots and wheat because those are used for taming things. I don't know if the raspberries are. Um, I don't think I've stumbled across anything yet that says it eats raspberries. So those may not be used for taming. Oops, I don't know. Um, but I'm going to go ahead and plant some carrots here. And I will end up redoing the entire layout of where the plants are at some point in the future. And kind of put the things next to each other. So like two plots of wheat next to each other and the two of the carrots next to each other. Cotton will probably just stay one. Cotton's really not a huge demand item. But it is handy for the string. And... 
No, string's handy for a couple things. I don't really know offhand what even uses string, other than like, uh... Ah, he glitched through. Good for you. Uh, other than for like handles. I think that's really about it that uses string. So, meh. Uh, I want to do some pretty creative stuff with this. And I guess I could do it now as any time. I just need to figure out how this is going to work, though. Okay, first off, can I make stone tile stairs? That's the first and most important question. Stone tile. And I can craft into split stone tile. And I can turn that into checkered stone tile. So I can't make that into stairs. Hmm. Disappointing. Because I wanted to use that as a stair. Hmm. <laughs> well, I'll have to use something else then. Uh, my plan is to do an underwater viewing area. So I got to figure out. First off, I might even going out an even number of spaces here. One, two, three, four, five, six. And one, two, three, four, five. This actually needs to be one further out. Hmm. Good, 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 good. Hope there's not water on the other side of this. As that would be most inopportune. And I think there is on the other side of this. And that has to use a pickaxe. Yes, there is. Oh boy, oh boy. Let's throw that block back in. That should go away by itself. Uh, all of my glass I put in a chest. Oh, I did that all off camera. I did a bunch of organization here in my, eh, whatever you want to call this, my main room. Um, as you'll notice, everything's labeled now. Chest is pretty much just all dirt. My wood stuffs. Or his ingots fuels. I uh, finally turned all those leaves I had sitting around in my wood to oil. I'm um, putting food in here. I will chuck that food all in there too. Um, just some miscellaneous stuff with all my glass, which I need the obsidian glass here. Uh, animal eggs for when I eventually have some place to spawn these guys in. Uh, giant red, actually, I could go ahead. I've got just some random ground nodes here. Which bones really aren't ground notes, but whatever. And then uh, different cobble type things. So cobblestone, stone tiles, protection blocks are in there. And they're all locked. So, oh, didn't know I was that open. So yeah, nobody's going to be able to just steal my stuff anymore. Which was super rude of somebody to do. But I guess that's what happens. Oh. I should have grabbed these tile. Well, I guess we'll be running back in real quick. I only need four of them. I'll just take everything. Why not? Um, technically, I'd probably do without. I could like place some other node and then dig these out and then replace them. But it seems like a lot of work. Oh, actually, I needed six anyways. So that's just as well. Okay. So get out from there and then dig this open. Perfect. Now, to figure out how in the world this works. Um, first off, I think I need to put a torch there and a torch here. And I'd probably actually be better off putting like glowstone or something of that type out here because that would just make more sense. But eh, whatever. Okay, so the plan is... Now this extends out six. I really don't know what the plan is. What if we do... This is going to be a tricky thing to do because of the need of air. Oh, but I can cheat and breathe inside of a torch bubble. Yes. Beautiful. Okay. I need to go deeper yet. And I don't know why I'm mining this. Okay, if I go to there, and then if I put 
obsidian glass up there. Oh, hey, sweet. I didn't think that would happen. The water flows out. Perfect. Now, to make this connect to up there. How do I do that? And does this need to be deeper still? Okay, that's connected there. I put... <laughs> what if I pull this wall back? That won't hurt anything, though. It shouldn't. This whole wall should actually get rebuilt with something. Oh, let me just focus on this one side. I could always do the second side off camera. I don't think that would kill anybody. Shouldn't. Okay, that actually has to be out further then. Yeah, let's throw that dirt back in. Okay, so if I have something three wide, I'll just throw the dirt here for the time being as a space keeper. Do stairs there. That doesn't really work though. Yeah, it does. Stairs there and then uh, stairs somewhere else. I don't have any stairs on me. I don't want to wake my baked clay on stairs. Can I make stairs out of cobble? I don't think so. Oh, I can. Nice. These are just temporary. They'll be replaced later. Is that even going to be workable? No, I hit my head on that is a problem so the obvious solution here becomes to simply make the stairs run the other direction altogether I guess that works not exactly what I wanted to do but it will work so we do this and then remove these and that one actually should have stayed there, but fortunately I can just fill it in with some good old cobble and it won't matter. That, yeah, that won't matter. Okay, good. Do that, do that. I guess I'll throw a piece of dirt there as a space holder. And the only reason I even had to put anything there was so I can place this. Which actually I could have clicked on the back wall. Eh, whatever. All right, so we got a nice little stairway now. Um, I really want to get something different for lighting. I dislike torches. Just because it's so, it's so weird. Like, you would never actually use torches in the real world to do this. Okay, now. This is going to be an issue. I'm going to have to keep going around to get to the outside. That's gonna be lame. It's gonna waste so much time. Of course, I guess once I figure out what I'm doing, that really won't be a problem anymore. Because I'll just be following the path. Okay. So here we are. And my question is... Okay, so I'm gonna remove this stone and we're going to put the floor one lower in here and honestly that's enough there even I just need to see how the obsidian glass is going to react with the water here um, this side I guess I'm going to have to build up fortunately I have um, you know an unlimited supply of dirt pretty much and go down and start placing the stuff going out I don't know how far out this should necessarily go um, I guess for the time being I'll just do this that needs to go bye bye I'll place one there just for good measure I don't think it's gonna matter at all 
Okay, and now I can actually get in this way. Yeah, okay. Pull out your old shovel. Uh-oh. Uh, we have a problem. I don't know where this water's coming from. Where is the water coming from? Oh, I know where the water's coming from. Right here. Mmm, okay. It's coming from somewhere else. Where, though? It's the only opening. Isn't it? Yeah, it's the only opening. Okay, I'm thinking the problem is... And I was... I was afraid this was going to happen. The water fits through on a diagonal. Which means I have two options. I can either put dirt running along the sides of this path. Which I really don't want to do. I'm going to need so much more obsidian. Or I line the side wall here with obsidian. No, wait. I'd have to make the top wider. Yeah, I'd have to go four wide. And that would keep the water from flowing in from these corners. So, for example, if I do this, I'm going to need so much more obsidian then. And actually, then I'd want to relocate this to a different spot anyway. But if I did this, and that, and that, and that, and that, um, what do I want to do here? I want to get back inside is what I want to do. Swim down, swim in. All right. So now, if I go ahead and place dirt there. And I don't know. Oh, that's why. And then run to here. And I think I need to plug that hole. Oh, and that one. Is this water going to go out? No, because that became water sources. Arrgh. And this is why I don't like building underwater. Because it's a pain. And it doesn't work. Okay. So we got that. Unfortunately, this is all water sources now. Okay. And now we just dig this out. Alright. And you can kind of see where this blue stuff's appearing there, but it's not here. And now this... Whoops. Should have left that one filled. There we go. Didn't become a water source already. No, it didn't good. Yep, 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 yep. Let's plug that hole. And that one. So now it's a safe area to walk under. Because I made it wider. Man, this is gonna be a real pain. Ah uh, yeah, 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 yeah. How in the world is this gonna work? So it's probably not a good project to start on. Hmm. What if I did this? Okay, but I still see the black line because it's a corner. All right. But at least now I can see out. Uh, yeah, this is this is not going very well. So it looks like this is what I need to do. And the only reason I need to do this is so you can actually see stuff. Because if only the Roof is see-through. Whoops, didn't mean that one there. If only the roof is see-through. All you can see is what's directly above you. Nothing that's to the sides. And it would be nice to see what's on the sides of you. Okay, so now that can go bye-bye. 
And all of this dirt should be able to be removed. Oh no. Nope, let's fill that hole up. And actually, I'm going to go ahead and plug that too. Alright. So it's a little leaky right now, but it seems to work. You can see out through the side there, which is pretty cool. The question is, how do I remove these? Yeah, this is so tricky. Okay, so we'll make this wider here. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and make it wider there too. Alright, and then... Oh, hey, there was something up there. Oh. A box. Because it makes sense for that to be in water. This whole wall needs to be replaced with something different than what it is. Right now I'm just going to go back to dirt. And then this upper row needs to be swapped out with obsidian glass. Like that. Fortunately, there is material there, so this is actually not such an issue. Good. I thought this was going to flood everything instantly. But no, it's not, which is nice. Um, I'm going to throw a torch there. Oh, and we'll take this out. Okay, then, got to get back topside one last time. I could actually just jump a wall for all that matters. It's all water over here anyway. Except there was a shark right there. Well, if any luck, he'll ignore me. Or I'll just outswim him. Okay, then let me come back in here. And remove all of this dirt. And then this stone. Eventually, that flowing water on the edge should disappear, as it did here. Oh, wait. There we go. It just from which side and the amount of normals or something. I don't know. I also don't know why I have this little bit of light there. Oh, from the torch down below. Duh. Okay, so that... In a nutshell... Let me get out of this bobbing water. Whee! That in a nutshell is how the underwater observatory will work. And it's going to just go into kind of a big U shape. And then I'm going to have to excavate all the ground down there. And tuck in some protection nodes. And yeah, it should be pretty cool once it's done. I just want to make sure that you use, um, you don't use the halo selection. Because that's going to show on all the glass and make things hard to see. So I just want to use the outline. But it should work. I guess in the next episode we'll be finishing that up. So, yeah, I'm going to cut this off here. Thanks for watching, and I will catch you guys all next time.